Hello, this is Breuer, and welcome back to another episode of our Let's Play for the Total War Pharaoh. I almost forgot the name for a second there. Uh, we are playing as Seti again. Uh, things are progressing pretty good. We are back at war, actually with two different factions right now, because why not? Um, so we just finished uh, getting our upkeep kind of fixed again, and we're going to start advancing on both of these fronts. Uh, first up here to Minifer, and the other one over here to, what is the actual faction name? Uh, Het, Hetnasut. And this will both give us some good um, legitimacy land. So Metaphor will give us this legitimacy land here. And actually, I think there's another one up there somewhere. And this guy will give us, obviously, Kimenu, which we're going to be going for first. And we'll see where that gets us. But let's go ahead and intern. We do have a lot of military. Three actual armies. Two will be advancing. One will be staying back to defend our homeland as needed. But uh, we're still short on food. But as we, as we do some uh, attacks here... We will gain a little bit more food that way, which will be good. And we do have a uh, ambition, which we still got 17 turns left. Not gonna be easy, because um, we do. He has a lot of land, but we'll make it work. All right, so we're gonna go ahead and advance this way. I guess we'll go ahead and advance into the tree area here. Go towards this land. Oh, we are losing so much food right now. Uh, probably because I think we're in a drought. Oh, we lose our... Do we lose our upkeep when we leave the leave the zone? That might be exactly what just happened. I bet that is. This is going to be a little bit tight then. Um, yeah. Fate I mean, we'll make it work, but definitely going to be a bit iffy for a bit. Actually, I actually have no idea what happens if we run out of food. Oh, did we not renew yours as well? We forgot to renew yours as well. That's okay. We can renew yours. That'll help a little bit with the food situation. All right, we got barters available. Oh, I bet we did. We lose a barter too for food. We did, and I think we're gonna okay to continue with this barter as much as possible. I'm okay with giving you some bronze for some food. That is okay with me. Uh, we're not really coming after you anyway. Uh, what else we got going on? World decree available. I mean, I need more royal decrees that give us food. Diplomatic relations with different people. I mean, can I just search for food? Oh, probably not spelt that way. Food. Hmm, doesn't seem so. Um, all sources. In provinces with the max idle workforce, which we're actually going to get there soon. That might be useful. Why is this locked? Is it locked? Oh, it's locked because this arrow goes up, or not, not down. So that's fine. Um, more stone, workforce growth, workforce cost, some happiness. Uh, less upkeep. Actually, I haven't been thinking about that. Yeah, less upkeep would be useful for us. Oh, there's food right there as well. Oh, an allied with Egyptian faction, which we are. We are allied with an Egyptian faction, so that is also an option. So, okay, so upkeep. Let me just make sure I didn't miss anything here for that. I hadn't been thinking about it from that angle. I mean, I do like a lot of these archer things as well. We'll get there. Another god dedication slot. There's an upkeep right there. Faction-wide for tier 3 units, though. Okay. We only have a couple of those, although they are obviously quite expensive. That's tier 4 units. That's tier 5 units. Okay. There's gotta be... A, is there no upkeep for lower tier units? We got a lot of those. Maybe we just have to switch to the higher tier units at some point. Influence from promises with monuments. I think we come down here to the Nile Ever Giving, which seems like the best way to do that is to go through the bronze, which seems fine to me. Um, so you're out of movement, you're out of movement. Uh, what else we got? Court action available. Do not be distracted by my imperial grandeur. I mean, to your duties. I guess we will actually, you know what we're going to do? We're going to go ahead. Sorry, I hit the wrong button. We're going to, we're just going to go ahead and go back to gossiping with you. Better to have smiles at court. Instructions available. 
you can do the higher level grain pit. Seems relevant. We'll drop us back down to zero on the happiness, however. But the other thing we wanted to get again was the bronze. Do we want to wait for the bronze first? We got a lot of bronze. We need to get the food fixed. So let's go for that. And then Abju, you were going to go for... Oh, I keep forgetting what it was. What were we going to go for with you? I guess anything we get reduced upkeep here would be good. Come to think of it. Hadn't thought about it from that angle from within the provinces, because we do have a guy that's just sitting in this province. Do we have anything that reduces upkeep? Hmm. Don't see anything. Uh, oh, there's upkeep right there. Um... I didn't think about these reducing up. So I guess we could always rebuild the Grand Temple of Osiris again at some point. Or we could just do the Temple of... Oh, okay, okay. So this is different. This is a little bit different. I see how that works. I guess we got upgrades over here too. This will reduce upkeep a little bit. For armies in this province. That... I hadn't thought about doing the irrigation networks because of that. That's... That is a reasonably good idea. I'm glad I thought of it. Um, in fact, we have two of them. Two irrigation networks that would help. Now, granted, this army would have to stay here, but not a terrible idea. Uh, we could also reduce with the tax thing. I think we'll start with that. Oh, I'm happy with that. Assuming she's coming up to help me, maybe? I, can't, I don't know if she was for sure declared war with us. Uh, oh, this is amazing. Yes. We are okay with this. You give us tons of food. We'll give you a little bit of stone in return. It's a lot of stone compared to how much we're making right now. Uh, but we could fix... We, we're not... We could make more stone. This is this is just too good. That's a lot of food. A lot of food. All right. Gain a trait. Construction cost goes down. Got the granary. Resource depleted. Stone and Abju. Um, okay. I, I knew that the resources can can deplete. So I suppose it's just a matter of time. What? So what does that mean? Does that mean that... Now we still gain stone, don't we? But we gain less... Hmm. I wish it showed it here somewhere, but like how that affected us. Because I'm just not seeing it. I mean, I see that we're getting less stone, but I don't see the breakdown of what... Oh, there we go. So that's the rich deposits. So I guess we're still gaining stone, but we're just not gaining from the rich deposits. Do we see that up here on this other stone guy? Uh, like for you. I oh, see we're at zero there too. Interesting. Huh. I don't know. I'm not entirely sure if I understand exactly how all this works out. I mean, it still looks like we're gaining stone, so I guess that is good. Uh, do we want to just lower the upkeep I'll slay now? In my way. Let me check the other things real quick. There's a barter here. I'm glad uh, I really don't want to give you stone now, to be honest. So we're going to say no. So we are actually married. Are we like legitimately married? She just called me husband, so I assume that's what that means. Um... And then what else we got? Court action, of course. And then let's go through our construction. Start with Wasit. I 
don't know that we need both these buildings, to be honest. Which one do we need the least? I mean, the happiness is actually okay right now. If we rank this up to max, we'll actually get a little bit of happiness from high influence, which we do have high influence. So I think we could actually get rid of the happiness building here. With minimal penalty. Power is nearly Let's do that. Uh, Kent Min. Still wanting the bronze. We're a long ways away from that at the moment. Uh, Abju. I guess we'll go for the... I mean, stone is a little bit low right now because of things. But again, upkeep. We'll grab the upkeep stuff. Alright, so you're good still, I think. I don't think we have any bad guys down here that we're worried about. So let's go to SETI. Mightiest of princes. And we'll... And we got 11 guys there. I'm not super stressed about that. Them. Uh, we can just occupy it straight up. Okay, we're going to occupy it straight up. Crush any resistance. Was not expecting Power that. Is mine. And then I guess we'll go for... Do we have enough movement to keep going? The old that? world does not concern oh, Where are you at? There we go. No, we don't. Of Egypt. Unless we can just attack him because he's like right next to us. Ah, we can. You have shown excellent tactical foresight. Reinforcements stand by to aid you. In oh, the from the garrison. Cool. I mean, obviously we're gonna auto resolve this. He's got a lot of really good units. Uh, we will lose a bunch of reinforcement units. It looks like, but none of our main units, and I'm okay with that. Use the reinforcements. Yeah, I mean, I don't see any reason why we don't just auto-resolve this. It looks like it's going to be a decisive victory for us. None can withstand Seti. Um, I mean, this is where replenishment could become a little bit more valuable, but honestly, we didn't lose hardly anything. I think we're actually going to take the morale. Begin with their hands. Cool. I am very happy with that move. We'll go ahead and move. Oh, there's a oh, there's a couple guys running around down here. Uh, where's our guy? There, no, where is he? Oh, here. Um, the Empire. I mean, I would love to come up here and just deal with you, but I think we're just gonna keep advancing here. We might need another military up here in the north to kind of help defend things. Let's go ahead and move Strike our. Oh wait, through. nope, stop. Can Push you not on. get into the water and just come across? To no. Victory. Why can't you get in the water? Alright, we'll figure that out next turn. I don't know why you wouldn't just get in the water. Um, unassigned skill points for SETI. What are we trying to get to? We're already at 11. So that helps us get one of these things. Once he hits rank 16. Probably want to start getting a balance of these other ones. So that we can get maybe one of these 666s if we want. I mean, plus 15% food when he's in a province. It's really nice. So that looks good. Also consider moving some things around, but I think we're mostly okay with what we've picked up. So I guess we'll get a four plus fours across the board in case we want to grab this one first. We'll do that. I mean, I guess anything that reduces upkeep though too, which we do have a lot of reduced upkeep with from him, which is really nice. Yep. All right, what else we got? Construction available. Generals have not moved. Sute. For Pharaoh's glory. Let's see, just poke around, make sure we're not missing somebody that's snuck in. I mean, I suppose I could send you up to go with after these guys for right now, and that might be the right move. This is the water of life. We'll get you moved up there. You are our primary. The Nile will guide us on. Defensive military. Cool. And then construction. Squass it. We're trying to build. Um, I mean, upgrading this at some point might not be a bad idea. But only if we have happiness issues. We're not really dealing with happiness issues right now. Can't men. We're waiting for the bronze, which we need to be five workforce. We're not there. And then finally, Minifer, which we just picked up. Um. I mean, obviously, happiness is going to be a thing. 
for a little bit of time. But I think we're going to hold out and to get this once we get some workforce. Yeah, I think we're okay right now. Uh, outposts. We actually have two trading posts? Oh, no. Look up. I was looking at it wrong. Uh, that's okay. And then we'll just move up towards... Wait, what is this? Oh, is this a... Does this one have a restriction? It does not seem to have a restriction. I did not realize Minifer was across the water. Uh, oh, so you are just completely ruined. Um, I guess we go for Minifer first, get that, and then we'll drop back and pick this one up, maybe? Something of that nature. I mean, these guys are going to be... Ah, uh, no, he went away. Okay, that's good. This guy's just going to be a little bit annoying, I'm assuming. I just realized there are crocodiles or alligators. What is it What is it in Egypt? Crocodiles or alligators? I'm assuming because they're aquatic. Aren't, they, aren't alligators more aquatic? No, I think they're both relatively aquatic. I don't remember. i suddenly feeling like an idiot because I don't remember. All right, so you did destroy some outposts. I hate you. Your one little guy destroyed some outposts. Really? I mean, I guess we take a detour just because you're going to annoy me if I don't, or do we? Honestly, I think we're fine. Sobek will guard us on our journey. I will prove myself. Okay, that's all good. By my divine command, let us begin our work. All right, Mosset, you are going for... You got rid of this. It opens up the door for things. You currently have the Grand Temple of a Moon, which, again, not really super useful to us in the grand scheme of things, other than legitimacy. I don't remember what I was going to go with for you, to be honest. And we're already building the tax collector's office. Could always build the summer festival grounds for more happiness and food. I don't know. Or we can go for a temple. Temple actually might not be a bad idea. Want to do another pata? Maybe keep pushing that favor up. And they both give us less upkeep. Yeah, I think we actually do for another temple. 10% production, less upkeep combined. I mean, we don't have anybody over it now, but if we did, it would help things. Versus just 10% food plus some happiness. But we're okay with happiness right now. And I think this, does this give us happiness as well? Yeah, it does. So, let's go with the Pata. I think there's a lot of value there. Kent Min, you are going for bronze. You're not there. Uh, you are going for Abji. What is Abji going for? Uh, ha, ha. I don't remember. I mean, over here we're doing upkeep stuff. I still remember what we were doing here. I think we're just saving up for. We get better tax taxation stuff. So maybe we just do the other upkeep. Well, we don't have any military here now, so the upkeep is less valuable. Could just grab a stone. A little bit more stone coming in. Probably a reasonably good idea. And then finally, Minifer. Really just need... Oh, you're actually backed up being somewhat happy at the moment. So I think we can kind of just chill with you for a little bit. We'll get you up to rank 3 uh, at some point, and that'll be good. Cool. I'm happy with all that. I didn't realize the bunny rabbits... Oh, the bunny rabbits actually settled this. Which... Where's the bunny rabbits again? I don't remember who the bunny rabbits are. That's a little annoying. Uh, but we'll figure that out later. We were going to go for Menifer anyway. All right. So, Seti. Crown Prince Seti. Looking good. Let's go for... Over here. Prince of Egypt. I'm going to be grumpy because we are currently... In your land, but I don't really I'll care. In the Nile if I must. All right, all that looks good.
peace is a delicate balance. I always seen this one before. So we are getting a call to arms. I guess we'll join on the side of our ally. We'll keep that going for now. Go away, dude. One little dude. Civilization in peril. A plague. Oh, over here. Not even near us. There's a lot of the land, a lot of the world that we don't even know about. Uh, we refused that. You were still raiding by yourself. We can join the civil war. Uh, let's do. Egypt is in need of governance. Yeah, we can't Let do this again. Begin. Guess we'll just gossip here for a minute. The um, see all that happens in here's the civil war. I am sure you have impressed them. I put us at war with her. It might. Which, if it does, that's gonna make things a little awkward. It does. Okay. Well, I mean, honey, <laughs> honey, boo boo, um, honey, dear. Um, I love you, but I'm just saying, you know, it is what it is. It does mean we could take this Every finally. Brings me closer to glory. This actually might be a bad idea. Come to think of it. I mean, we need to finish. Yeah, this is awkward. <laughs> it's actually going to be really bad. Um, oh, how are we not at war with you? Oh, because we joined the Civil War. Uh, you know what? That's to fight. okay. Question mark. Oh, no, that's our other guy. I'm looking at the wrong guy. Let's come in right there. Okay. Because you're coming up here to deal with this dude that's just been raiding us and annoying me. Not a chance. Um... So I'm going to move you up. Doesn't really matter where I move you to. This is the water of life. Guess we'll move you up there. Guess we'll take out the three units first. Maybe I shouldn't have joined. Actually, truth be told, I actually thought we were going to join the Civil War on her side. I don't know if I really realized that we were going to join it on our own side. I mean, it makes sense now that I think about it, but at the time that I hit that button, I was thinking we would actually just be on her side. And I was like, eh, it's a, it is what it is. We'll be on her side, no big deal. But obviously, Bold that's not how it worked out. Docking. I think we'll still be okay. I think we can still handle all of this to together. Um... I guess I you are going to come deal with this guy first, maybe? Why can't you deal with this guy right now? That is not Do we have to get past her? We might have to get past her first. She's got a lot of units here. Will those be in reinforcement? I don't think those will be in reinforcement range. I think we can take her by herself. It's going to be a close victory. I mean, we could arguably... Oh, she does have reinforcements. She does have a lot of reinforcements. Wow. Still, I think, I mean, it says close victory. Doesn't say anything's going to be killed on our side. Let's go for it. Sorry. Oh, sorry, honey. Sorry. Did we just kill her? She's dead. She like completely dead. <laughs> we lost a lot of units. We didn't lose any actual troops. I think in this case, we take the replenishment because yeah. That is going to be... We just need to get back ready to fight because she has another huge army over there. We just destroyed everything she had. Punishment will be good. And technically we could, I guess, do another oh, attack here. Egypt. Looks like we can attack this little group down here. Which we will. You will know defeat. Obviously they're going to be easy to auto-resolve here. Oh. Um, I think we'll take the morale this time. Not even fit for labor. All right, and then you can still come up here and potentially unmatched. attack her. Yeah, let's just finish it. Get all her troops done.
Nice. Slice of victory. 13% replenishment. We'll take the replenishment this time again. Put them to work. All right. Wait, did you just get movement back? I reap divine blessings. All right, we're going to go ahead and go for target that. You are already moved. You have already moved. Cool. I don't know. I'm. Things happened. I mean, she does have some troops down here that are going to cause some problems. We probably need to get another military up and running somewhere. Possibly down here. So that we can both deal with this and also at least get this piece of land back. That would be ideal. Uh, if we're going to get another military, though, we might want to do it in our main province. Just because it's just better. Better units, right? I mean, it's a bit risky just because um, it's going to cost a lot of food again. But we're back techni technically positive at the moment. I don't know if it really matters which one we go for. Let's just go for you. You've already got three points into something. And let's look at what we got here. We only got one elite unit here. I mean, we might as well grab the one elite unit. Um, Prove your strength, and then we'll grab some actual better units here, too. I mean, getting a couple, like a bunch of these tier four turrets, probably we need more would be really nice. Let's start with that. We'll figure out from there. Actually, what we may do is let, we're going to send you back south again, even though I just brought you up here. You would make more sense to send down there. We'll let this guy just build up a few troops just to kind of help defend up here, and that'll be fine. All right. I'm happy with that. Uh, outpost. We know about the outpost. Ancillary available. Which is what? That? Oh, it's just gear. Okay. Um, common light armor, common medium armor. Now we'll just keep doing the common medium armor. I think that's okay. Small shields. A little lag all of a sudden. I don't know why. I mean, I guess we'll grab the large shield. Crude Kopesh. Sure. We have a light... Oh, we could actually do this. Give him a chariot. Why not? Which means he can't do the shield, right? Or not? What, did I, what, is he, what else can he not do? Oh, he's got the wrong weapon armor stuff. Let me just do none for a second and see what he's able to use with this. So he can't have a shield at all. He can't do the medium armor, but he could do light armor. What about weapons? No. I guess he needs the like a halberd or something. Okay, so let's not do that then. It's fine. We'll just do all the stuff that we are going to do before. Cool. I'm okay with that. All right, we're going to put a cut in there. When we come back, we're at war with three different people now. Fun times. We'll see how that goes. <laughs> so far, so good. We'll find out. But I do appreciate you guys watching. May God bless you. And I hope you join me again next time. Thank you and goodbye. I wanted to give a special shout out to the following channel members. Thank you so much for supporting the channel.